Ooh, fancy. That's a little fancy. Wow, 11 years ago. Oh, this might be Simon and River. Yep. We're in trouble. We got cut off. Cut off from what? Our platoon, Simon. We got out playing for the mm -hmm. independent squad, and we're never going to make it back to our platoon. We need to resort to cannibalism. Cannibalism? That was fast. <laughs> right. Did they have rations or anything? They got lost. We're going to have to keep them in. Aren't you supposed to be practicing for your dance recital? I learned it all. That's wrong. It's from the book, River. No, the book is wrong. This whole conclusion is fallacious. Damn, she is smart as shit. So, how the independents cut us off? They were using dinosaurs. Jen taught a boy. Language, young man. <laughs> he was Sorry, Dad. The, the independents attacked us with dinosaurs. Simon lost his head in the heat of battle. <laughs> Not me, Gunchy. Because there were dinosaurs involved, I think we'll let it slide. Did you get my wave? I got it. Your text showed it. I got the whole thing during a board meeting, thank you. If I had a dedicated source box, it wouldn't short out. I lost half my essay. Yes, and you'd have access to any tiens sur deux that filtered in from the cortex. I absolutely forbid it. Dad. Dad. I will not have it in my house. But since your mother's already ordered you one, I guess I should give up the fantasy that it's <laughs> in my house. Are you kidding? You will repay me by becoming a brilliant doctor. That's the deal. That's the deal. Dedicated source box. Brilliant doctor. When do I? Many years. Dad, this yeah. is so Dobby and Hua. It's really good. I know. You think I let you work with something second rate? Thank you. You're worth it. Aww. Now, do you think it's possible for you two geniuses to give your tired old dad a couple minutes quiet? No! No, you wouldn't do it! It's okay. It's not it's okay. okay. You can't just dig into me, shove 20 needles in my eyes, and ask me what I see. We won't go in. Look. No test today. No ready test. <laughs> Stupid son of a bitch dressed me up like a boron doll. No tests, no shots. I'm not. Yeah, what did you do? Like that. Who's being tortured and all this stuff? Not him. We are going to be out to her hut to debun our stuff. So she's added cussing and hurling about things to her repertoire. She really is a prodigy. It's just a bad thing. No, a uh, bad thing is when someone's yelling and screams the cattle. You understand? You ever see cattle stampede when they got no place to run? It's kind of like a, a meat grinder. And it loses half our herd. She hasn't gone anywhere near the cattle. No, but in case you hadn't noticed, her voice kind of carries. Mm -hmm. We're two miles above ground, and they could probably hear her down there. As soon as we unload, she can holler until our ears bleed. Right. Although I would take it as a kindness if she didn't. Human body can be drained with blood in 8.6 seconds given adequate vacuuming systems. See, morbid and creepifying, I got no problem with. Morbid and creepifying quiet. is cool. This is paranormal. No, quiet. Captain. Handcrafted by government scientists who thought my sister's brain was a rutting playground. I have no idea what'll set her off. If you have some expertise, I'm the doctor. what is that? That's a post hole. Oh, very big. You make holes for posts. It's, uh, it's dirty and sharp. Let's come over here. Jenny, Prairie Paradise. Good God. They're asking money for this crap. Oof. You don't Hard to believe, ain't it? Glad you're out. Hmm. Give you a chance to have a little fun. Fun? Right. Yeah, I, I, uh, I consider this fun. It's fun being forced to the ass end of the galaxy to get to live on a piece of lost so wreck. We eat molded protein and be bullied around by our pian de 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 of a captain. You might force you to be. It's fun. Yeah, you kick your ass off. What's up? Whoa. Sorry? Serenity ain't what's up. No, I I, I didn't mean... Yeah, you did. You meant everything you just said. Well, no. Uh, actually, I was being ironic. 
So in, in, in the strictest sense, you I didn't... You're being mean. Oh, that's that's right. Call him out. And if that's what you think of this life, then you can't think much of them that choose it, can you? Showed all his arrogance, didn't he, babe? You don't talk man shit about my shit. You know I run this shit with the damn mechanic shit. This is the last time. Last time with cows. I think there was an idea regarding beagles. They have smaller strawberries. <laughs> he brought in the beagles too. Also, you're a disreputable man over here. Better go take their money. Gentlemen, this be the Grange Brothers. Hope you're in the mood for beefsteak. Attractive animals, ain't they? They ain't well fed. Scrawny. Hey, wow. Milk and hay, three times a day. Fed to my beautiful woman. That was something to say. They just branded. Now you boys are hitting all the selling points. The first brand's a dead giveaway. Claim them as your own. Twenty ahead. That's an amusing figure. In light of you already agreed on thirty with Badger. Before we've seen them, they're atrophied. Stand around on ship for near a month. My comprehension is less muscle, more tender than meat. Thirty. Right. That's a good argument. Problem. No. About a minute from now, we'll agree on twenty-five. See my mic jumpy to you. I'm like, telling you, like his dude, backstory, he be. This dude was a G. Babe. He was a G back in the day. Is he be reading people, babe? You want me handling? Okay. Okay, let me know, man. <laughs> Just tap me in. Yeah, let me know. Morning, officers. I'm thinking, maybe we walk away and kind of... I'm thinking you do that and we got ourselves trouble. Come on, ladies. Serious trouble with the UOS variety. We can go to 25. Well, you're taking a loss, but you seem like clean and virtuous boys. Done. Clean and virtuous boys. Marcus and Nathaniel Graves, you are both wanted in connection to the illegal killing of Rance Durbin. You are bound by law to stand down. You know, I'm starting to find this whole planet very uninviting. Yeah. How did she be? How did she get so far away? This is why I don't take you outside. where we had behind all the dirt in the western front and front. It's like a tunnel. Hey, look. Just picked it up real quick. Show beef? No, sir. You're looking at the proper owners right there. I'd like Life to see sir. some paper on that cat. Here we go. Never go smooth. Never go smooth. And never go smooth. <laughs> Over here. Oh, 
Stampede. Dumb enough to get himself grabbed in broad daylight. Don't have time to be beating the trees looking for him now. No assurance we'd find him or that he wouldn't need a doctor himself. I'm not talking about Simon. I'm talking about medical facilities. That's not an option. Nor is it a discussion I much want to have at the moment. It doesn't matter what you want. He's dying. And we need a doctor now. What medical facilities? Mm -hmm. Like a hospital or something. But you gotta be, you know, you gotta be in public. You gotta oh. be books there. We got. No, they're trying to stay. We gotta sell the doctor. Real doctor. This guy sells the doctor. Get him straight. They brought home a doctor. Thank you, Lord. Do y'all have any tools for me to use? Because I can only just talk to you. Yeah, I'm snatched you up a doctor, but did you anybody steal any tools? We gotta have the type some. Dear Diary. Today I was pompous and my sister was crazy. Today we were kidnapped by a hill folk, never to be seen again. It was the best day ever. He's going through all this shit already? Oh, <laughs> Amazing we kept him this long. It's amazing we kept him this long. He's out though. He did this for me once. How's he doing? I cleaned it out, wrapped it up, best I could do. I don't know. We were headed for help. Right? Captain will come up with a plan. That's good. Right? She's so loyal, Possibly right? Possibly not recalling some of his previous plans. We left them back there. Yeah. Don't seem right. You sure this is where you want to be? Oh, I'm fairly certain it ain't. Sure to ask nicely. Alliance Cruiser Magellan, this is Firefly Transport Serenity requesting permission for docking. Firefly Transport Serenity, stand by for docking orders. I feel like it would have been a much better idea just to go back and get their doctor. I don't figure it's fancy as we used to, but that's what we got. Glad, Doctor. We I got you, Doctor. Praise the Lord. Throw Lee, he'll show you what's what. What's your name? Simon. Well, 
Hello there. Well, who are you? This is River River. Just, uh, just sit down over there. Has there been a, is there a sickness here? Nothing is special. Just people get sick or injured. Well, mostly people heal on their own, but sometimes... Sometimes you need a doctor. Bring me light and any supplies you have. Sometimes you need, as I see. Yeah, he's useful. I mean, he was useful on the ship too. Because he's a doctor. He's very useful. It's felt like he's he's needed. You saying what about the kind of reception we're out to receive on an Alliance ship, Captain? Absolutely. What sanguine? Sanguine, hopeful. Plus point of interest. It also means bloody. Which comes on the options, don't I? <laughs> We're requesting aid. No other purpose. We got papers. What's your business? We're a supply ship. Freelance. Had an accident this morning. Crewman got hurt. We need medical help. It has to be better than slow. Official seal's out of date, Captain Harbatkin. We ain't been through a checkpoint in a while, sir. You gonna see to my man? How did this happen? He Bystander in a gunfight. Back on Chen Yi. You can check. Not he nor any bars with the aggressors. We aren't an emergency facility, Captain. Our services aren't available simply to anyone. Man. Why? I did. His brother. <laughs> right. Get this man to the infirmary. Right, right now. Dude, who the oh, fuck is this? this? Nigga is an OG. When are we gonna get the information? Man, I'm telling you, he's somebody. I've been telling you. Yeah, now you, you're yeah. on my so team. Saying, look, what right is she? She's been he is special. Time. He is a spe he's, he's got history, coming. babe. Oh, take him now. Take him right now. She won't get a good conversation out of Ruby, I can tell you that much. That little girl's mute. Do you know the cause? Was she born deaf? Oh, no, she, she was talking. fine until two years ago when she stopped talking. A place like this might be good for you, sister. Quiet, safe, a place where folks take care of each other. Mm. Yes. I see. There's like a lovely little community of I, kidnappers. Right. I was about to say that. Judge not. They took us off the street. Sometimes life takes you places you weren't expecting to go. Life didn't bring us here, those men did. You were on a transport ship, right? Taking a journey? It's the way of life in my findings that journeys end when and where they want to, and that's where you make your home. This isn't our home. If it isn't here... Where is it? Where is it? place gives me an uncomfortableness. So what do you figure? Shepard's got some kind of connection with the Alliance? I know what it looks like. Still, don't surprise me if he did. See, that's my whole problem with picking up tourists. They ain't never what they claim to be. They ain't never what they claim to be. <laughs> Jade is so extra. River? River. What's wrong? River's gone. So's the girl. Oh, I think it's I'll check out back. It's just plain. River. Don't. What is that? Can you? Oh. I fixed them. What is it? Oh. Fix them. Oh, I fixed them. Stay your dress. Now what you do is you push them up. You have to eat. Hodge berries. Do you remember when we found those giant hodge berry bushes on the Camerson's estate? And we thought they'd grown wild, but... Long while ago. I took you to 
take you away from there. No. I know I did. You don't think I do, but I get confused. I remember everything. I remember too much. And some of it's made up, and some of it can't be quantified, and there's secrets. And it's okay. But I understand. You gave up everything you had to find me. You found me broken. It's hard for you. Give up everything you had. Maybe. Everything I have is right here. Aww. He's such a cute thing. Like he, he, uh -huh. Keep up your strength. We won't be here long. Daddy will come and take us home. I'll get better. I'll get better. Is it better than the cameras and berries? They are. Except they're poison. <laughs> <laughs> you really do? Made a face. You are such a brat. Aww. Bed now. Well, we should probably think about doing the same. It's been a big day. Walking with the abduction and all over. With, you know, with us being kidnapped and stuff. Here. Yeah. You know. There's a house set aside for you. We've been looking for a doctor for a good while, so things are ready. Really? Yeah. Her sister got killed. Mother got crazy, killed the sister. That one lived. Ruby talked to you, honey. It's true what she's saying. Poor woman went out of her mind, tried to kill the two girls. Ruby lived. Sweetheart, you are an angel. No one's been able to get Ruby to speak, even a peep. <laughs> it's a miracle. That's what it is. Ruby doesn't you. talk. Her voice got scared away. What, is she reading people's minds? I hear cricket. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This girl reads minds and spins falsehoods. She's a witch and we must purge the devil from her. With fire! Oh, uh, no. Well, are they going to move back? Like, how do you get into this situation? Well, it's back to you. Alliance? Yeah. Let us go. Let us go. What kind of a dent card gets a second reception and send off? I am a shepherd. Folks like a man of God. No, they don't. Men of God make everyone feel guilty and judged. Mm -hmm. That's not what I saw. You like to tell me what really happened? Tell us. It's a long story. I'm sure they will know. Maybe someday I will. It's good to be home. Oh, you called it home, baby. Badger just hailed us. Getting impatient for his chair. Wants us to drop it to his men on the calendar fed base. That would be a hell of a lot easier to do without the two most wanted on board. Life would look to be simpler, us not carrying fugies. He is right, you know. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Simpler. Is he gonna go back and get him now? I don't think so. Alright, Agatha. It's your yeah. moment. <laughs> Take me instead. Take my life for hers. The witch must die. God commands it. Sorry for him. 
I didn't feel sorry for them. They kidnapped him. It's true. It's not going to stop us, Doctor. Post holder. Digging holes for posts. Ship and I miss out. I'm sorry. Oh, you were busy trying to get yourself lit on fire. It happens. Captain, why don't you come back for us? You're on my crew. Yeah, but you don't even like me. Why'd you come back? You're on my crew. <laughs> are we still talking about this? Like, why are we? I already said you're on Johnson my crew. 10. But you don't even like dress. me. Uh, Mouse came so far already from the first episode. They're <laughs> becoming a family unit, baby. That was episode five of Firefly, and this was a nice, simple show right here. Nice, simple episode. Um, I do like how the whole team is becoming more of a unit, of a family, and but most importantly, I am very excited to see what's going on with the ship because um, he got some G credit over there now. You know, he bossing up. Um, I don't know what was on that ID card that he got, but it definitely ain't a man who just grows strawberries. So they ain't finna roll out the red carpet just for some somebody, you know. I think he he used to be I don't know what I ain't finna guess. He just he but he got some clout. Let's just go with that. And so I'm very interested in that part, and I also and I also enjoy seeing the team unit become a family and be super tight together. So I thought this was a nice simple episode right here, and another stepping stone to some more awesomeness. Uh, yeah, so I especially love the backstory of River and Simon. I really appreciated that they invested an entire episode to give us that backstory, to see them mm -hmm. as kids, and really, like, to me, solidified without a... I mean, it was pretty 
you were pretty sure that they had a bond, but this episode by far really clearly established how close the two of them are. And yeah. it was very heartwarming. They did such a great job with uh, with this episode and making that so clearly evident about the relationship, and I found it adorable, and I really appreciated it. And we finally got to see River... I don't know if it's a power, something, what? <laughs> but what yeah. it is, but she is like reading minds. So cool. That's something that we have that could be very useful, especially with oppositions. If she could like hone it in yeah. and I something. loved, I loved her explanation too, that she fully remembers everything that's ever happened to her, but she recognizes she gets confused because some of the things are not clearly have happened. So she gets lost in time when things, I, I just like that explanation because I feel like it really clearly articulated where she's at and why she's so oblivious sometimes, but yeah. and yet she does know what's happening. So I thought that was just, I just liked everything they did with River this episode. And yes, um, as far as the uh, shepherd, who the fuck is he? What did he do? Do we ever get to hear his story? Because I'm like so intrigued with all of that. I want to see what it is. Like he's he's one of the most fascinating characters on the show because he's so low key and so like humble and so chill. Mm -hmm. But like he's a badass. The fact that he recognized. And called uh, Mal out and be like, yo, they look a little sketchy. They look a little nervous. They might, you know, something might happen here. Yep. And it totally did. So G shit. How this all unravels from here will be super interesting, yeah. but I totally love the, the dynamic of the crew. I love Mal's line about your crew. Like, why are we even talking about that? Like, I'm going to yeah. go get you. You're part yeah. of my crew. Yeah. Period. Um, I just like it. I love this episode so much, so I can't yeah. wait for the next one. All right, well, look, thank you guys again for watching another Real Talk Reaction for Firefly, Season 1, Episode 5. And until next time, people, peace.